Hey family, I am back with another mini fridge review. This time I am reviewing the Magic Chef, the 4.5 cubic feet one with the two doors, fridge on the bottom, freezer on the top. So this is the box that it came in right here. And this is the energy guy. I've already taken the energy guy off. The energy guy was posted on the front of the freezer. I selected the stainless steel. Um, it does come with a protective film on it. And the sides as well comes with a protective film on it. This item was not shipped. It was, um, I picked it up from the store pickup. And I just want to open it up and share with you how it looks inside it does have a plastic feel to the top it's kind of like shelving i would say it's not metal and i like that it's easy to clean i feel and yeah so let's open up the top part this is the freezer kind of hard to describe how big the freezer is um but i will later on as you can see it's a film on the top i will later on um put things in it to show the dimensions. So inside of the freezer, you have this metal rack here, and then you have the bottom space here, and um, you have a plastic door shelving. The rack is not adjustable, but it is removable, held in here by tape. Let's take this tape off. I've already plugged the unit in and um, I do have it set to off. Okay, so let's open up the back, the bottom part. The bottom part does have a protective film here as well. Here's the way this looks on the outside. Um, it is about, in height, it is about 44, um, about 44 inches tall so according to my counter it is a little bit taller than my counter right here um, the Arctic King is shorter the Arctic King is about 32 inches right here so that gives you the the distance right there on the height okay so let's open this up I do not see a protective film on the stainless steel parts I do like the grainage on here. It is more silver than it is gray. All right, so we're getting inside here. You have one, two, three glass shelves. Um, I have not kicked it on yet, so it is gonna take a minute to get cold. You have from zero, one, two, three, four, Let's see how far it goes. It goes up to seven for your settings. You can hear it just now kicking on for the video sake and the noise in the background. I'm going to shut it off. You do have your light switch right here. And let's go ahead and take the plastic wrapping off the tape. Okay. One thing about these shelves is that the inside lining has um, levels so that the shelves are basically um, custom. You can like lift, place it on another height so that way you can put your bottles in there and that kind of thing for better storage, um, custom, customability. Okay, so they just move in and tuck. At the bottom here we have our crisper draw. And the bottom here does have a glass shelf as well. I'm doing this one-handed, which makes it a little bit challenging. So as you can see, you have this little shelf right here. Let's get this out of the way. Okay, this shelf does move and slide. So I wanna make you aware of that. And then you have your draw here. Your draw is just, just like that. It's nothing that is sliding. 
it's not like a sliding rail to it. okay so let's see what's in our packaging here okay looks like we have the manual an ice cube tray similar to other mini fridges and i don't see the registration packet but it is more than likely in there so this is our crisper drum it's clear and then you have like this little area right here so that's that along the door you have your two or five can tray here let's remove this tape okay and then on the side right here you have your two four six can holder clear trays and then this one for your two liter um or your juices your orange juices that kind of holder and then at the bottom here you have a clear shelf for um setting small items maybe yogurt or what have you um fruit cups uh, also mini sodas and water bottles as well i'm going to go ahead and stock up this mini fridge to give you a good idea of the dimensions and the size as far as usage okay so i did open up the packet um there was an ice tray and the menu i did not see a registration packet so these are the things that came in this plastic baggie I went ahead and kicked the refrigerator on and I filled it with some items. Didn't have anything to put in this door as of right now, but I have the kids' fruit cups, sherbets, ice creams, and slushes. Same thing that are usually in um, their mini fridge. And then on the bottom, to give you a look at capacity, um, I have their sandwiches at the top and then some. Um, puddings, some water bottle, um, eggs, their fruit, um, veggie, and some cheese sticks in this drawer right here. I find that these cheese sticks are perfect. I can actually put more fruit at the bottom right here. And then on the side, we have our cans. They just fit very nicely. And then these are how they fit on the side right here. I was able to put kind of three water bottles in here. Um, you can put two comfortably, a uh, third one will just kind of, you know, get kind of squished in the back. Um, I didn't fill it up yet with cans, but I did want to just kind of give you an idea of how it does look, how they rest in the slots. And then at the bottom here, I have some, um, yogurt cups and some yogurt tubes for the kids. So this is just kind of how it looks just to be able to, let me back up a little bit, just to be able to see how much space you have as far as usage when it comes down to um, the cubic feet. All right, that's it to this video. I wanna thank you fam for watching. I love you so much.